Hey guys, Cheese Star Gamer back with some more playing for you. As you can see, we did beat Nanovirus the last video, thankfully. <laughs> uh, we have Bio uh, Weapon left and we have Simeon Flu. And interestingly enough, I've not really played much of the Simeon Flu. So I think I might switch things up a little bit and go ahead and play that instead of the Bio Weapon this time. And I'll play as the Bio Weapon in my next video. Okay, let's see. I believe these are pretty much the same. Oh, I didn't unlock a lot of these, did I? Let's see. With Aquasite. Reduces research from Genesis Experiment. Well, since that's the only one I have, it's all I can get, obviously. Extreme file. And I don't have any of these. So, I do need to work on this more. Um, in light of that, I'm going to play on casual just so I can unlock a bunch of stuff. I'll go back and play ALZ113. That's what it was called in the movie, if you hadn't seen that. Um, I will eventually go back and play this on normal, but as I haven't played it very much, I still don't have a very good strategy for it and I do have a lot of genes I need to unlock so it's triple speed as usual now this one is interesting because um, once the apes break out of the uh, research facility, you pretty much have to start using their ability here. Uh, it's, you know, it's pretty much throwing into, uh, into, um, it's throwing the apes into their rise to power, so to speak. So. Okay. I'm not getting points too quickly. Let's go to transmissions. Pathogen able to transmit through physical contact. That's a good one. I'm gonna get air one, however, because we're in such a warm environment. And actually, now that I think about it, I should have started in Africa. <laughs> But I just wasn't even thinking. But well, that's okay. Let's see, nausea. And it cost to devolve. Okay. Um, so we really need to start working on the transmissions then. Because, yeah, I get a feeling that they're going to start working on that cure pretty quickly. At least we're getting points now. Um, let's go with... Oh, the drug resistance is never a bad thing to get. Spreads to China. We do have the drug resistance and spreading via skin contact, so... Yeah, I was going to say, that should spread pretty quickly. That's just telling us about the world data. I don't always look at that. I probably should use it a lot more, but I don't know. I just don't. <laughs> Headache developed. I'm gonna go with, let's get our water and more air. Okay, so we have officially been spotted. Okay, now that we've gotten out of the lab, like I said, this is where you need to start activating these abilities. 
And of course, I'm out of points, so. Authorities weren't able to contain them. The apes escaped. So. And now this becomes kind of like the zombie or the necrovirus because you now have these labs that are going to pop up and you have to destroy them basically before they destroy you. So. But at least we're spreading pretty quickly. Um, target. Okay. We definitely want that. Reducing likelihood of being detected. Organized travel. Colonies. Increases transmission. Protects. Generate DNA. Uh, that can't hurt. DNA points are always good. And vomiting mutated. That's lovely. Um. We do need cold resistance because we're starting to head northward. Colonies increase a transmission, increase DNA from colonies. Increase combat abilities. Travel. What do we have over here? Okay. Increasing chance of ape to ape transmission, which would be awesome if we were in Africa like we should be. So, let's come back over here. Let's get our organized travel because that will come in handy. Um, let's take some of. Let's see if I can do this right. Oh, why can't we go? There we go. That's what I wanted. And now that they are migrating, we can start getting these. Abilities. Well, we can ride horses now, theoretically. <laughs> I just kind of want to get all these, um, the combat upgrades because those are going to help destroy the Genesis labs that pop up. And if there's one thing I am not good at, which shows in, um, the Necrovirus Let's Play, is I cannot destroy those labs. Um, or I guess their bases or whatever they are with the military units. Um, government commits taking a bit seriously. Okay, so we have another lab here. Soon. Let's see, I don't know if they have to be in that country or not. So we want to be right here. And then once they get there, I'm going to go ahead and try and attack them. So, okay, let's see if this works. Okay, good. That did work. And we have another lab here, so we need to get rid of that. Okay, let's see. Let's get our cold resistance too. Projectiles are awesome. Seafaring is good. And they do have they're dying in New Zealand faster than new people are being infected. That is not a good thing. So... Hmm... Let's, uh... See what we got going on here. 
every country is infected. 313 million are left healthy. 156 or 156 million dead. Sorry. Um, TA 2016. I need to start devolving some of these, I think. Okay. See if that helped. I'm not really sure what this does. Let's see. Oh, yay. Evacuate. The community and live in peace, working to rescue our apes and protect themselves. So it seems like I just sort of made my own um, base. That's the only way I can really think to equate that. That's going to cost 13. Definitely want to get rid of those labs, so let's see. Okay, 24. Boy, oh boy. Let's see. Migrate to nearby. Okay, so I thought there was like I don't know something more aggressive. I guess I'm not really sure what I'm actually looking for. It would probably help. Okay, well that's always good, isn't it? Symptoms, magic shock, often fatal due to. Okay, so if I get two more points, I can get a kill. Let's see what that does. Oh, well, I'm definitely getting a lot of points. <laughs> um. We can make bigger colonies and get more DNA points. And it looks like I just got another achievement. Got the oops symptom combo combo. Man, I can't really talk today, guys. I apologize. Let's go ahead and let's see. Everybody's dead, it looks like. <laughs> let's go to Canada. Okay, well 
there's that victory. You know, granted it was on uh, casual, but like I said, I played it the one time. I'm not very good at it yet. Even that playthrough, I don't think I did that well on, despite the three. So I will be playing that one again, and I'm also going to go back and play the bioweapon, which is another kind of tough one. because It's a very aggressive disease, but we'll go more into that in that video. Um, as usual, guys, like, share, and subscribe, and game on.